Lauren Davis, followed by Christia Houston. Lauren Davis, you all know me. We've been emailing a lot. This is Caroline Davis. You deserve to die. You deserve to die. How does that feel? Do you feel safe? That's what my 11-year-old daughter, Caroline, heard yesterday as she ate alone in the cafeteria and again on the playground. I'll let you hear her words. There's this guy named Mateo, and every time I wait to go into the to lunch, I wait for my class to go in before me. They always enter before me. He walks by me and says, put on a mask. And also when I eat, he walks by me and says the same thing. Today, when I was eating, he walked by me and said, you deserve to die. I didn't even respond. And then also at recess, he said, I deserve to die. Again, he's really annoying and just rude for someone to say that in general. Your lawlessness, behavior, segregation practice, are turning unmasked kids into the virus. They are not the virus. They cannot be contained. They are humans. You have coned off my child and PE like an animal. Not allowed them in the lunchroom with all the other unmasked kids. You have segregated them from their peers. You have caged them like animals in a plexiglass box to the point they can't breathe. The fire marshal came out and cited your district. Did you know that? Monsters, you're all monsters. You built this cage in the most public place, the library, to ensure the unmasked kids felt shame and to instill fear in others. You allow kids to meet with the art teacher at lunchtime, unmasked, to learn how they can pick their gender. When my kids had enough, enough, they went back to class and you evacuated the classrooms as if my kids brought a gun to school. You allow your SBDM chair at Dealey Montessori, Dustin Marshall, you know who she is, to incite a parent mob against my family? Good luck running next year. You are teaching fear. You are teaching hate. You are teaching 600 kids at Dealey that unmasked kids deserve to die. Stop the mandate and let me decide for my kids. And while you're at it, pay these goddamn teachers $3,000, you monsters. That's my child. Look her in the face. Christia Houston, followed by Ellen.